Oh, okay. Stream. Okay, so okay, please wait. Um, so you're going to like um let him listen? Uh, yes. So you're going uh, to okay. like um so I please wait. Uh, okay. okay, sorry. Uh, okay, now start it. Okay. okay. So, so let's talk about superstition. Yes. So first, you, uh, first can oh, I sure. explain my country superstition? Okay, sure. Okay. Um, I li I'd like to hear it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, in my country, uh. If we see black cat, uh, we should walk back. How old are we? Like I'm, I'm 29 years old. So if I see black cat, I should walk 29 steps back. Really? Yes, but, but yes, yeah. So I, <laughs> yes, I want to ask you. Uh, in your country, uh, really, is there some superstition about black cat? Actually, like so far, I haven't heard about it. I mean, like there are a lot of superstitions in mm -hmm. my country, but I haven't heard about that kind of superstitions mm -hmm. like black cat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, there, there are a lot. It happens a lot of time, but yeah, like I haven't heard it from my like grandparents or like gra my my parents also. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. I see. So in your country, like you're going to like have 29 um, steps it depends on your age yes but uh of course uh it is believed by uh old people and yes so recently i think uh, uh young people don't believe that and, and don't don't do that i mean yeah <laughs> yes but in your case like in your in your generation or in your age do you believe in the superstitions uh yes so but uh of course uh i don't do that recently uh i mean <laughs> i only do did that uh when i was young i mean mm -hmm. when i was six years old or seven years old yes yeah because actually like especially when we were like at our young age when we are told by our like grandparents mm -hmm. about their like um, beliefs mm -hmm. so we tend to believe them also because we feel scared oh, okay. <laughs> if we yeah. don't follow them right mm -hmm. okay. but i think right now like um believing that kind of superstitious it's mm -hmm. something like w this generation can do because they have their own beliefs also oh i see yeah, yeah. okay so yeah but here in philippines there are a lot of superstitious also <laughs> already oh so uh okay uh first uh i want to ask you uh like uh about numbers like yeah. yes and um, in, in my country uh number four is uh unlucky number and people usually hate the number four and yeah uh, in your country is there a uh, unlucky number maybe like there are but I don't know exactly, maybe like seven or nine, like mm -hmm. odd numbers, or we because sometimes we follow like um American, like we are being influenced by American. So sometimes we consider this like number thirteen, you know, like Friday that uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so we consider that mm -hmm. as an unlucky day or like unlucky number. Uh -huh. Yeah, because whenever we have like on Friday the thirteenth, we have to be careful, mm -hmm. especially when we go out, when we travel, because we sometimes think there would be a consequence if we do a lot of things in that day. Mm -hmm. So bad luck or something bad will happen. Mm -hmm. So we have to be extra careful. Oh, like I see. Oh. Thirteen, like oh. Friday the thirteenth. Oh, I see. So, uh, yeah. you said uh, number seven is also unlucky number in your country. Mm -hmm. Oh, but it's not really like they said. Mm -hmm. But I don't know exactly the reason. Mm -hmm. But many people like yeah, thir thirteenth from like the oh. Americans. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, I see. And also here in Philippines, mm -hmm. like hotels. Mm -hmm. Usually, like almost maybe most of the hotels here in my in my country, don't have number thirteen. So oh. like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, mm -hmm. eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen, oh, fifteen, sixteen. Oh, yeah. 
it is so similar to Japanese uh, because yeah you didn't have four right oh, yes 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 <laughs> one two three <laughs> yeah. five six yes. seven <laughs> yeah so yeah. do you know the reason why uh, Japanese don't like number four do you know no like oh. I am really wondering because here this in this company in this mm-hmm. building yeah actually at first I didn't notice but my friend told me mm-hmm. because like I was going upstairs mm-hmm. like. I I was oh, I'm going I want to go to the like fourth floor and then my friend told me fourth floor mm. the next the next floor is fifth really where is the fourth so like I was thinking ah okay no fourth <laughs> <laughs> yeah so one two three five there is no like fourth floor in this building because the owner of this is Japanese oh really oh it's yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Oh, okay I see but can you tell me the reason behind that uh, like okay um because I think. It depends on uh, Japanese pronunciation because uh, first we usually pronounce number four like she, she, she. Yes, and we also pronounce this, this like she. So it is same pronunciation, number four and this. So mm-hmm. we usually hate number four. I see. And what does it mean, like bad? Bad. Yes. And so number four uh, is. If we hear number four, uh, we also uh, think it is similar to death. So oh, I see. yeah, so we so don't like. So that's why you don't have this like four. Yes, yes. <laughs> Just but like in like America, like but the difference is like there they have like thirteen and mm-hmm. you have like four. Yes, yes. I see, <laughs> but do you like believe in that? Or you just like um agree because that's what they said. That's what they have told you. Um, sometimes I don't believe, but some spotition I believe. <laughs> so <laughs> yes. Yeah, maybe like in my country, maybe it's really weird. Like, you know, like taking a picture, right? Mm-hmm. And in my country, like um, no, when you are going to take a picture and with your friends, mm-hmm. and it's not like good when like three people are going to take a oh. picture. Oh, yeah. yeah. So yeah. it should be like even numbers, like two, mm-hmm. four, mm-hmm. six. Oh. Yeah, because like number three, like one of one of you, like mm-hmm. that will be like dead. Mm, like that. Oh. Yeah, but mm-hmm. I'm not sure. It's really creeping me out right now. <laughs> oh, okay. But I don't really agree with that. Maybe before. Uh-huh. Oh. But now I'm not sure if it's still like working. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, uh, uh, another Filipino teacher said the uh, same thing. Like, they don't like number three. And if they build a new house, uh, uh, they usually make two rooms or four rooms so they don't like number three no three yeah. <laughs> oh i see okay uh. yeah number three also because like it's odd like odd numbers and usually like odd numbers are like unlucky like mm-hmm. bad luck oh i see okay yeah uh-huh. but me i don't have any issues with numbers they are just numbers mm-hmm. anyway <laughs> oh i see yeah so uh okay next um uh, I heard from Serbia teacher like they believe uh, if they break the mirror, uh, they will be oh, yeah. unlucky in next seven years. So yeah. actually, like um, like for example, if you like um broke the mirror, mm-hmm. there would be like a consequence also. That, so that means bad luck. Oh yeah. It's either to your, like um a family mm-hmm. or someone related to you, oh, really? or like accident. It's bad luck. Uh, in your country, Philippines. In your yeah, oh, I yeah. See. Uh-huh. So like, if you suddenly like um break a mirror, mm-hmm. so maybe the first thing that comes to your mind will like um something bad would happen mm-hmm. oh. after that. Oh, I yeah. see. So so maybe it's like um someone related to you mm-hmm. or your relatives or like family members. Mm-hmm. Oh. Something bad will happen to them. Oh, so. Yeah. In your life, you didn't break the mirror yet. I have oh, broken right. okay. mirrors several okay. times, <laughs> but so far, yeah, like I didn't receive any like um 
result for that like bad oh, results oh yeah so, so maybe like if you really think about it like literal meaning mm -hmm. if you are like a kind of like literal person like you tend to like interpret things in literal maybe you would think in that way like oh something bad will happen mm -hmm. but if you're just like kind of person like you don't believe when you, you are not thinking about superstitious or any beliefs you don't mind about it oh yes yeah yes. because me i won't mind also <laughs> oh okay <laughs> yeah oh. also like frames or even like glass like that mm -hmm. okay yeah so so you usually don't believe superstition, right? Me? Yeah. But sometimes I do. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, when if it's really like um, really strange for mm. me, yeah. I do. Mm, but no. most no. Oh, okay. In my generation, yeah. Okay, I see. Yeah, but like for example, like spoon or like fork. If we like um fall down the spoon, so that means there would be like a visitor coming. Yeah, for a spoon, it's like male visitor, mm -hmm. and if it's like um fork, female visitor. Oh really? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. yeah. So that's why, like, um, when people here, they suddenly like um fell down mm -hmm. the spoon or fork. Oh, someone is coming. Oh really? Oh, I didn't, yeah. <laughs> didn't, didn't hear that. Okay. Yeah, okay. but here, like in mm -hmm. Philippines, we are mm -hmm. thinking about it. Oh, okay. So, is there a uh, uh, lucky? superstition i mean if it happens you get you will be happy like mm. that in superstition yes usually like during new year mm -hmm. we have this like belief that or tradition that pe most of the people in my country usually do so during new year like um we tend to make a lot of noises or we're going to like um we're going to use like up coins mm -hmm. And we're going to like make a loud noise through it mm -hmm. oh. and after that that means like um the entire year would be like lucky so we receive like a lot of blessings already oh uh, yeah you, you said noise a lot of noise no a lot of noise oh, really? oh, oh, yeah it's so very opposite in your country <laughs> oh yes oh. because in your country usually it's very quiet yes right? yeah mm -hmm. so noise how do you make the noise how how or maybe like we're going to like play a loud music or we're going ah, to use like okay. um cars like beep sound oh really okay so yeah uh, or like strumming something like that mm -hmm. or like fireworks also it's very popular in oh, my really? <laughs> oh it's, uh, i didn't hear that okay mm -hmm. so okay so okay thanks so much um uh, i'm glad to hear that you, but how would yeah how would in japan like lucky charm or believe mm, i think uh if you see uh four leaves clover it means lucky oh yes. yeah <laughs> also here in philippines oh it same is it the same yeah yeah uh, yeah yeah, okay. yeah. Uh -huh. four leaf clover okay and also if we see uh falling stars and if we wish something it it may come true mm. yes same here also ah uh, <laughs> yes yes and this supposition is same uh with serbia teacher said it is mm -hmm. same so it may be uh all over the world there, yes, there are maybe lot, it, yeah. it's like scientific mm -hmm. belief also but do you agree like have you ever tried like you saw a falling star and then you made a wish and then it came true um have no, you tried it but uh, i never see the falling stars I never. <laughs> really? Yes. yes yeah. So, I don't have. Options. You haven't seen even once. Yes, in my life, I don't. I never. Where have you been? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you don't go out. You just stay like at home most of the time. But uh, usually, I'm I'm in home, so I. Don't ah, <laughs> you're an indoor person. You yes. should go out sometimes. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so because yeah. I really love to play video games, so ah, yes, you're a gamer. They play some video games. You you have to go out of your <laughs> shell. Okay. <laughs> you have to like um expose yourself outside. Okay. okay yes. Yeah. yeah, you're not an outdoor pers person. I think. Yes. You're an indoor person. Yes. Yes. Uh, so mm -hmm. you cannot see a falling star <laughs> yes. in that case. Yes. 
Yeah, but actually, it's like a rare case, like when someone sees a falling star. Yes. Yeah, it's only like me. I have seen a lot of times, but yeah, it's rare to oh. happen actually. Uh, did you wish wish something? I yeah, I did. Oh, is is it that come true? Came true? I'm not sure. <laughs> oh okay. Maybe like me in my case, be, maybe before like in my younger years, in mm -hmm. my younger age, I used to believe in that superstitious. But mm -hmm. you know, like when you get age, when you get mature, like you don't like yeah think about those superstitions, especially mm -hmm. like. When you show a falling star, so it's, just, it's just like a falling star, mm -hmm. like that. Oh, so yes. nothing will happen if you like um wish something. Okay, I see. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but me also like um when I saw a falling star, I still do it. Like I wish just oh, in case. Okay. So... Yeah, but of course, if I want to like um wish something, I have to work for it. <laughs> oh, okay. I see. Yeah. So, so by the way, um. Yes. Uh, as I said, I'm a video gamer. So uh -huh. yes. So do you like do you play some video game? Video games. Mm. Actually, I'm not really into video games. Oh, okay. So yeah, I'm not really fond of like yeah like gaming. Mm -hmm. But in my Philippines, video games are very popular, and one of the most popular video games here is Mobile Legend. Yes. I'm uh, not sure if you heard it already. Yeah. Uh, a lot of Philippine teachers said same thing. <laughs> why Legend is so popular in your country? Yeah, and I'm not sure why all are why people are so adapted in this game. Like they can play this game the entire day without eating, without doing nothing, just yeah. playing. Yes. So, uh. Is it a um, uh, mobile game? I mean, not you usually. They usually play on their smartphone. Yeah, smartphone. Uh -huh. And actually, they can like um play with other people. So in this like um game, like they can meet like different people mm -hmm. or like different nationalities. Mm -hmm. They can connect with different people. Oh, so they yeah. can like um form like a group. Oh yeah. Also. Oh, uh, I see. Okay. Yes. And yeah. uh, there is a competition of mobile legend in your country. Yeah. And uh -huh. this year, I think my country mm. won. Already? Oh. Yeah. 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 Last year or this year? Mm -hmm. I, th yeah, I, um, I guess uh, if you win the competition, you can get a lot of money. So is there a lot big prize in, in the competition? Maybe. Maybe. Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> I I don't have any idea about it because I don't also like watch games or I don't uh, play like that. Yeah. Yeah. But how about you? Like, what kind of game do you play? Um, called like a uh, fighting game. Fighting. Fighting game. Yes. What do you mean fighting game? Um, I mean, in this play, uh, there are two person two people and they fight each other it is fighting game and <laughs> the famous title is uh, Street Fighter 2 is so famous do you know do you know I'm not familiar like I okay. only know like Minecraft and uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. other other games yes yes this uh, uh, a Street Fighter yes uh, Please check it later after this class. Ah, yes. ah, actually, I like um find it. Oh, so they're like two people. Yes. So they're fighting. Fighting, yes. So uh, that means you're when you play this, do you have a partner, or do you need a partner when you play uh, this? Ah, yes, of course, yes. But uh, of course, uh, you can play with a uh, computer. Uh, I mean, yes, but oh, yeah, but yeah. usually we play with. Uh, other people, other mm -hmm. person, yes. It looks like familiar to me. <laughs> really? Oh, like. Yeah, I think like before also. Uh, yes, because it's so country. it's so famous in the world. So yeah, yeah, you may know that. Yeah, I see. So you always play this. Y okay. Yes, almost every day. Oh, oh my god <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> morning to evening um uh, no uh, uh but 
in my day off, I I usually play morning from uh, from morning. I... To, yes, but so maybe this is your kind of like um relaxing or stress reliever. reliever. Yeah, yes, yes, for me, yes. You can like um express your feelings through playing this game, especially when you're angry. Like, yeah, I want to kill you. Oh, yes. <laughs> I want to defeat you. <laughs> I hate you. Yes. Yes, you are right. Yes. <laughs> yeah, and if you are like, if you lose the game, oh, that's really <laughs> yes. disappointing and frustrating. Yes. Uh, so only when I win this game, so I I can feel comfortable. But if, if I, you lose, <laughs> yes, if I, if I lose. I. <laughs> How do you feel if you lose the game? I um uh, I said I, I will kill you. <laughs> I will kill you next time. Okay, yes. Revenge. Yes. Vengeance. Yes. Yeah. I see. But since when you started playing games? I think about ten years ago. Ten years ago, I think. Oh, yes. it's quite long already. Yes. And um, three years ago, I joined the competition and got first prize. Wow! In congratulations. Japan. Yeah, Japan. In Japan. In Japan. Yes. Was it, was it your first time? Uh yes. Uh, wow. Uh, sorry. Uh, I joined a lot of competition, but uh, three years ago, I it was my first. Uh, For, first win. First, yes, yes. Wow! Congratulations. Yeah, thanks so much. Yes. Wow! And how did you feel? Uh, at the time. Uh, I, I. Can't say enough, but it was so so good. It was so good. Yeah. Yes. You you were like so fulfilled and satisfied. Yes. Yes. I see. And like, how did you start playing like games? Ah,、uh, how? Yeah. How did you start? Um. Ah,、uh, I watched the YouTube video. So and it seemed so fun. So I started.、Mm-hmm. Yes. I see. So that's why, or you don't like go out most of the time because you're a gamer. Yeah, yes. <laughs> you just stay at home. <laughs> yes. As a kid. Yes. I see. And how long also like do you spend in playing? Like how many hours? Ah,、uh, each day, each day. Uh huh. I think almost ah、uh, two or three hours. I think.、Mm-hmm. Yes. But recently, ah,、uh, to study English is more. Interesting for me. So I think you're、yeah. very busy right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes, <laughs> you're hectic, like working,、mm-hmm. playing, and learning. Yes. So I don't play recently video games. Oh, I yes. see. Yes. You like you're focusing on learning yes. English. Yes. Yes. So here at Native Camp, how many lessons do you usually have a, a day here?、Mm, four or five lessons. I see.、Yes. Four or five lessons. Yes. Yeah, and we don't have much time, Kazuki. Thank you so much. I had a great time with you, and、yeah. I hope to see you soon. Have a good night. Okay, take care. Thanks so much. Bye. Bye. Bye.